You say you'll be down in five The smell of your perfume Is floating down the stairs You're fixing up your hair like you do I know that I'll be a mess The second that I see you You won't be surprised It happens every time It's nothing new It's always on a night like tonight I think that you can read my mind Anna. Today finally came after all of the planning, stressing, traveling, and deciding we are here. It feels like a different lifetime ago that we sat on the playset at Bryce Harris and just talked, shared our dreams and our hopes. I'm not going to say you saved me because you have done so much more. You opened my eyes to life, the world, people, everything. You challenged me to be a better man. I'm so excited to start our journey as husband and wife. It's not a new start, but a continuation of the wonderful life you have given me over the last five years. I am so blessed to have met you, to call you my friend, and now my wife. I was so nervous today, like this is for real, but I know there is nothing I can't do when you are with me. I love you, Anna. Let's go have some fun. You did very well. <laughs> Garrett, I love you so much. Over the past five years, we have shared so much together. We have stood by one another through everything, no matter the obstacle we have always gotten through it together. You are my biggest supporter, my number one fan. No matter what crazy dream I come up with, you always jump on board. You make me laugh every day. You hold me when all I can do is cry. You are the one constant thing in my life. The one person I couldn't live without. It is so rare to find love, and it's even more rare to find a love as pure and passionate and true as ours. I love you today and always. Happy wedding day. Love on. Watching you is all that I can do. Oh, 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 I'm speechless. You already know that you're my weakness. After all this time, I'm just as nervous. Every time you walk into the room, oh, I'm speechless. Oh, you know that. Father God, we invite you into this place as we begin the marriage ceremony. We ask for your presence to fall softly on everyone that is here and guide us through the transition of blending two families together. Ariana, you are my best friend. You challenged me to be a better man. You pushed me to not be Eeyore and mope about and to sit around. But you pushed me to get out and experience life. I knew you were the person I wanted to spend the rest of my life and forever with. Garrett, you are my absolute best friend. Reconnecting with you five years ago and you becoming my friend is the greatest gift God ever gave me. You've seen me angrier than I've ever been, sadder than I've ever been, but happier than I've ever been too. Yet through it all you stayed, you hold me up, support me, love me, and make me laugh so hard I cry. Your light burns so bright in this world and you're a blessing on everybody you meet. I promise to protect you 
and to help you maintain your love for life and for people in general. I promise to support you without hesitation wherever your dreams and passions take you. I promise to never stop being your best friend. I promise to respect you and to cherish you as my partner throughout our journeys and adventures and to never stop pushing myself to become the best version of me. I love you and I can't wait to see where our journey takes us. You are absolutely my lobster, my best friend, no, the best friend, period, in the whole world, <laughs> that anyone could ever ask for. You work so hard and give so much, and I just want you to know how much I love you and how I feel lucky every day to call you mine. So I promise you this, I promise I will laugh with you in times of joy and always comfort you in times of sorrow. I promise to share in your dreams and to never stop supporting you as you pursue your goals. I promise to listen to you with compassion and understanding and to speak to you with encouragement. I can't wait to build a home together, filled with laughter, learning, and light, shared freely with all who may live there. I promise to be your partner, friend, and lover today and all the days of my life. don't know she can be somewhat of a force <laughs> and I don't mean it in a negative way I mean she has a fire in her a light that burns extremely bright and she has a lot of passion and a huge heart and sometimes that can be taken um, her passion can create very passionate moments <laughs> I mean I've seen him happy I've seen him sad but the happiest I ever seen him was when I came up to KU and Ariana was there and I mean, I've seen him happy before, but I've never seen him that happy. So, um, I just wanted to say, I'll keep it short and sweet, but I just wanted to say congratulations. I love you both, and I cannot wait to see what life holds for both of you. And we couldn't ask for anyone better to have in our family. We love you like you're our own. You're like a son to us. Jack is happy to have another guy around. Trust me, he needs you. And Ariana, I, I'm not crying, so I'm not going to get into this much, but you know how much I love you and how special you are. And as I've always told you, I love you big, you rock, and you always make me proud. But it's not about making me proud. You've made yourself proud. I'm blessed now to have a daughter. I always wanted one, but God did not give me that daughter. We tried for many years to have another child, and it wasn't God's will, but today, I get that second child. I am so happy that you found someone who loves living life, who truly loves living life, who loves experiencing new things, who likes trying the things that you like, trying new foods, who likes to travel, who challenges you, and you challenge her. What I have found in Anna is that we fight furiously, we love loyally, and I really do believe that this relationship is forever. I love you, Anna. Thank you for loving my son. Thank you for raising an amazing young lady, woman, wife, and future mother to my, my grandchildren. <laughs>